So the Florida Gators are continuing to absolutely dominate the 2024 recruiting cycle, and they just landed their top recruit of the entire class. Let me introduce you guys to the sixth best player in the class of 2024, the second best defensive lineman in the country, and the third best player coming out of the state of Florida. I'm of course talking about six foot six, 260 pound defensive lineman coming out of Mainland High School, LJ McCray. LJ has been moving up the recruiting rankings heavily these past couple of weeks. I mean, on some websites, he's only a four-star recruit, but on 24-7 Sports, he is not only a five-star recruit, but he is the sixth best recruit in the entire country. He is joining an already stacked Florida Gators 2024 recruiting class, being the, the, being the third five-star recruit that the Gators have landed and the fourth defensive lineman that the Gators have landed in this class alone. Leave this video a like all my Gator fans and show your love for your new five-star defensive lineman LJ McCray and let's take a look and see how dominant that this, that this guy is remember that Jesus Christ loves you more than you will ever understand and now let's get into this video three two one all right let's see what my guy LJ is looking like out here all right just, just body him up off the plate and then get your hand up, get your hand up in there let's go so these are his senior year mid-season highlights so this is what he's looking like right now Oh wait, just just get up underneath him, okay? I know that that I know that that tackle was going out for a uh, I know that the tackle was going out to go try and set a screen, but phenomenal job of dipping that shoulder and getting up underneath. What's going on over here? I hate when teams be doing stuff like this. It's like if you say that you're not good enough to call plays, just say that. Don't don't be trying to get all fancy and whatnot. This is a big defensive lineman, six foot. Dang, absolutely bullied him. Just drove him right back into the running bag. Where are you going? Nope. Yeah, this dude, he's definitely gonna have to work on staying a little bit lower and really getting some more pop with his with his engagements. Right now, it's just hard for anybody to even move him. I mean, he's just he's just a big body to have to move. But this dude, hey, you know, you go out there and you go and continue to develop him. I personally, just based off of what I'm seeing right now, obviously, you know, these recruiting these recruiting websites have a lot more tape on them. As of right now, I would, I would have him as a four-star guy with a lot of upside. Five-star and a top 10 recruit in the country is a little rich for me. But as of right now, this, this kid, he has a lot of promise. He's very athletic and he's quick with his hands and his feet. I mean, just look at how quickly, like when he, when he does need to, look at how quickly he gets into the backfield. Swoop, nope, where are you going? Patient quarterback, come here. And all these plays are from one game. Yeah, no, this guy, LJ McCray, he is nice out here. Where are you going? Get wrapped up. Just blow him, just blow him up and get him about the play. This kid is cold out here. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna say right now, this kid is cold out here. Nope, where are you going? Just get absolutely bodied. So overall, I like what I'm seeing from LJ McCray. Again, like I said in the video, five-star recruit, top 10 player in the country. It's a little rich for me. So that's pretty high to put him, put him up there. How the composite ranking has him as the 16th best defensive lineman. That's more of where I would have him, you know, great physical specimen six foot six 260 pounds he's got a great frame that he can grow into he's athletic it just doesn't look like he's put all the pieces together to be a very just dominant defensive lineman right now it looks like he's relying more on his power and his just sheer size rather than really getting some solid technique so that's something that he's gonna be learning over, over over the next couple of years, especially once he gets to Florida. But this is a player that has so much upside. I mean, you get a guy that big and then you end up teaching him some things, that's when you're gonna have a player who's gonna be causing a lot of havoc. So all my Florida Gator fans, I wanna hear from y'all. Comment your thoughts down below on what do you guys think of LJ McCray. Be sure to leave this video a like and hit that subscribe button and turn your notifications so you do not miss any of the fire videos that we drop on the channel. I love and appreciate each and every single last one of y'all and I will catch you guys in the next video. Ciao.